Hey guys, it's me, iPod Touch Stitcher 3. In this video, I'm gonna show you on how to jailbreak your iPod Touch second generation. The, um, this way is the easiest and fastest way I found, and also the safest way I found. And this um, way would not delete any of your apps or stuff like that. Okay, and let me show you that this is a second generation, second generation iPod. So you have the Wi-Fi connector and the volume rocker there, and just to show you. Okay, I have like a couple apps there, as you can see. I have um, like um, those apps, and like when I jailbreak this iPod or my iPod, it would not um erase any of the apps. And this works on Windows Vista, right there. This is Windows Vista, and this will this also works on a Mac. And I will have both of the links in the description over there. I will have the um, I will have the Windows and the Win and the Mac link over there in the description okay and like and then when you like click on the disc on the link in the description it should come up to a page like this right here it says rest no um 414 megabytes to the download link is located below so um so like so once you're at this um site what you want to do is um scroll down and right there where it says download link red snow that zip you will want to click on this right here uh, it says uh, please wait uh, once you do is click on that right there and it, and it will tell you um, where you want to save it um, I already have this file so I'm not gonna um, save it okay so let me show you what like this um what the file show should look, look like when you're done downloading should have that it says red snow so what you want to do is right click it click extract files and just click ok and just wait for it to extract ok and then you get this folder right here this folder right there it says red snow so, so what you want to do is um, click this, click this file right there, and then just um, and then we're done for like for right now, and then we'll go back to the computer right now. Okay, and then for this you'll you'll want to have your um your um your iPod connected to your computer, like as I have, and then. You'll, you will want to have it you'll want to put it to DFU mode and to do that you'll have to um hold down the um, home button and the sleep button for 10 seconds and then you should hear like a chime and then like um and then after 10 seconds release the um sleep button and and then keep on holding the um home button for eight seconds until you hear the other chime so I'm gonna show you um on how to do that right now just like this. Go like this, okay? Okay, so I'm gonna show you how to do this. So, so you want to do hold this right here, hold this for ten seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. As you guys can, can hear that, it chimes, so it's, so release this button, but keep on holding this button down here until you hear, until you hear like a chime. And and it, and it will say installing device driver software and then just let go and then your computer should have like a sign saying uh, uh, it should have saying this right here Apple recovery DFU DFU USB driver 
it like once it says that you'll want and then um iTunes will, um, will pop up and then you'll want you'll want to close that out because um iTunes would not recognize it because it's in DFU mode so just some um, close it out for now okay now now once it's in DFU mode still so have it connected to your um, iPod and press I mean and click this one right here where it says red snow okay click on that and it should say this DFU mode successfully connecting to server done and it should just start start jailbreaking by itself right so right now as we speak it's jailbreaking it and we're just waiting for this right here from the iPod to um boot back up and and literally guys this takes about 10 minutes tops as you can see like the um screen just just turn white now it just flashes and there's some um, sounds coming from my computer and now it says downloading jailbreak data so um, if you have like that little um, logo and and that right there then it's jailbreaking right now all it's doing it's uploading RAM RAM disk at their 80% So we're just waiting for this. And literally guys, this thing would this takes no more than like ten minutes. Sorry about that guys. Okay. And like there's like a little um loading screen right there. And like as you can see it, like the thing just um disappeared, like the black screen. And right there, there's like a new logo. It's, it's like a walking pineapple. And it says flashing nor. And all we have to do is just wait for that to go all the way. And to, um, what's it called? And to reboot. And then your iPod will be jailbroken. And what's different about this jailbreak is that um, it won't install installer. Sorry guys, but... This show, this some um, jailbreak way would not include installer, and and I and, and I think I, I really like that because um I use Cydia more than I do installer. That's another um difference between this and the and the quick feed um and the lip USB way, and also um um it does not come with a custom boot logo. What well, what well, and then that's a different. Uh, that's a difference right there. As you can see, it's um, installing bundles. So we're just waiting for it to um, finish installing the bundles, and we're just gonna wait for it to um, reboot, and then it will be jailbroken, guys. And and all of our stuff will still be on there. As you see, it's it's syncing thing, and now it's rebooting with the Apple logo there guys and I will have more um more um jailbreaking vi videos on like how to get uh free apps how to um get um Game Boy Advance to your iPod how to change the boot logo how to make your own themes how to get uh themes how to get stuff like that a, a whole bunch of a as you can see, it, it just rebooted. So what I do is just slide to unlock. Come on. Slide to unlock. As you can see. And Cydia, guys, right there. You see it for yourself, Cydia. And I do have all of the stuff. See, guys? And this, again, guys, is an, is an, e is an easy way on to on, on how to jump your iPod touch and this thing does include Cydia right there and I'm running out of time and this is iPod touch 323 don't forget to rate comment and subscribe and remember guys 140 subscribers and I will do a giveaway on a case so guys check this out the link will be in the description over there for the
Windows and Mac versions. Sci-Fi Touch, Stitcher 3, later.